monster as he goes through another bow and elbow tie up and a veal across the ring almost to the turnbuckle. But he is staring in the eyes of Madman Fulton. No fear at all in Robbie Collins. The crowd is fully behind him with a rear race, waist lock and a headlock. Madman Fulton tries to push him off with the tenacity of Robbie Collins holding on. Oh, the strength. Oh. But he does not release the headlock after getting dropped straight on his back. Uh, Robbie Collins has targeted the head of Madman and he is definitely um, putting an assault on that. That shoulder tackle from Madman Fulton has blocking that clothesline and delivers a clothesline of his own. And taking the man wow. out of the ring. Oh, he took back. I don't think he expected this onslaught from the redneck. Oh, you're right, Ruben. I don't think he did expect anything. Robbie Collins looking to go to the air one more time. Oh, what an uppercut to an in the air. Robbie Collins, that might have halted. Mm. He's got a lot. I mean, like as we said earlier, he has been around the world, and now he is just taking complete control of Robbie. It looks to me the focus of the main event monster is going to be the back of Robbie Collins. You injure that back, you slow him down. Madman just swarming over his opponent. Oh. And it's blatant disrespect did Colton Quinn. I mean, you would have to. It'd be a mistake on Fulton's part if he didn't take Robbie Collins seriously at all. Good counter by Robbie Collins. that's fighting back with right hands. Bounces off the ropes and eats a spin kick to the gut. Mm. He to the face. Atomic Ooh. drop. And a boot to the face. He is just having his way with Robbie. Robbie Collins kicked out once again, and Matt Matt Fulton's going to have to have wow, as he drives his knees into the spine of Robbie Collins. He's going to have to start making up his mind what kind of covers he wants to make. He's hooking the... Listen to this crowd fully behind their hero, the redneck kid, Robbie Collins. And he's firing back with the heart of the crowd behind him. Mm. But another another atomic, atomic, atomic drop. Misses the big boo. Go for a roll up. One, one two. Madman kicks out from the roll up and quickly back to his feet. This goes for another one. One, two. Oh, that was just a mistake from the, the ring bell crew over there. When, as Robbie ate a boot to the face and another dropping suplex. And we're still not sure right there to reinforce that that was a two count before he gets slapped in the face again I'm by another say, professional wrestler. Yeah, I'd be more scared of Mad Man Fulton than I would the status symbols as a whole. I mean, that's fair. He definitely has enough on his plate already. He doesn't want a whole nother, uh I'm not sure what the, all that's about. Ooh, oh, and he caught in a cutter. cutter. He took way too long, as you stated, Ruben. At the same time, Robbie is fighting back. Another right hand, third, a fourth. He's just going off. What is Robbie going to have to do to take down the monster madman Fulton with a nice Float over DDT, but he is way too close to the ropes. He's pushing, he's pulling them out. It Here's took the cover. too much time pulling them out, though. As Madman Fulton kicks out at two. I was good. Main event monster is really becoming a thorn in his side. Goes for the Frankensteiner, but he is caught and power bombed by Madman Fulton. And oh. turns him over into the. Boston elevated crab. Boston Crab, and now he sits all the way down into the traditional Boston Crab. If it looks like it hurts that bad, I can only imagine how it actually I feels. Mean, he is sitting on the spine of Robbie Collins. Then don't break. That, that, that spine is bending, but hopefully it don't break. He pulled him back away from the ropes. They are now in the center of the ring. What hope does Robbie Collins have? Nowhere to go. 
He's fighting with everything he's Look got. At the strength and tenacity by Robbie Collins, who finally makes it to the ropes. The Madman Fulton is going to use every bit of that five count, it looks like. Two. It's a slow count by Mako. That was a little slow. Well, that bro, minute. And Colton Quinn is out we here. We talked about him earlier. He is no longer in this tournament. Turnabout is fair play. Colton wants revenge. He got that cheer. I, I know he he's um forced back, spot. back to his feet. Wait a minute. Rolls up Madman Colton, but there's no, no ref. Three. One. One make two. Go. Three. Oh, we counted to five Mississippis and still. Could, you could have counted to three five times and he still wouldn't have won because the referee has to count it. Hard job for the referee making sure that uh Colton Quinn didn't use that chair. Oh! That man Fulton is pissed. Those are means of disqualification right there. Don't fall. This looks like it's gonna hurt. Aziz just continues to talk. Wait a minute, look! Bobby Collins. Do you see who's at the veil? Out of nowhere! Oh no! The referee was looking to, the referee at the back. The ref where, where, what just happened? J.J. DeVille came out. Mako, where are you at? Kick. Where is the what is one the Mississippi? Doing? Two Mi Mississippi. Four. I counted to ten Mississippis. Madman Fulton trying to come out here. Did, did Colton Quinn try to come back out here? As Madman eats another super kick to the face. Take him up for open season. And he hit, oh. he hit open season cover. One, one two. two. Three. Three.